when you think of the governor's goal, and I don't know if you've heard the specific goal, uh, within 10 years, 650,000 additional residents being aligned to or attaining an industry certificate, a two-year degree of employment. 650,000 in 10 years. That far is going to you know outlast you know his tenure and, and you know going well into his legacy. Probably far outlast many of our tenures. Except for Lee, there she's been there forever. She's going to stay there for everyone to make sure of that. Um, but when you think of the fact that we want, we understand that by attaining an industry recognized certificate and skill, by attaining a two-year degree leading to a skill and gain from employment, by attaining a four-year degree. Um, attaining a skill and gaining a little more employment. We are not only going to improve the quality of life of the, indivi of the individual families, but really improve the quality of life for the Commonwealth as a whole. If we can work to ensure that every community is filled with members that are not only able to contribute and, and sustain themselves, but contribute to the greater society, that's the path to you know, to, to, to the greater future. I was going to say enlightenment, but that's too, you know. <laughs> um, you know, that's the path to, to just, you know, a, a greater future. When you think of the fact that folks who learn a skill, folks that learn specific content standards, folks that can really advocate for themselves, are really the individuals that not only contribute to, to their neighbors, but have changed the world that we live in. You know, I've seen programs that have gone from vending machine repair to slot machine repair to mechatronics and now, you know, small machine repair. And, and they're not only, you know, fixing and installing and maintaining current technologies, but they're inventing current technologies. When you think of the folks that are working in our labs, whether it's a biotechnical lab or a welding lab, they're not the folks that are just, you know, uh, improving the quality of life, but they're putting a path in our quality of life. And when we look at our Department of Agriculture, for example, and agriculture is no longer farming. Agriculture is all of life science and technical sciences and engineering and math. I mean, it's, it's amazing what we see just in that happen. And the work that you're doing here today is not about the skill that you teach day to day, but it's the fact that you're teaching students to look beyond what they're learning and they're becoming the modern day inventor. They're becoming, you know, the modern day, uh, you know, creator of, of efficiencies within, uh, you know, within our, our practical world of, of business and technology. And you get to do that. And you get to do that. And that is some pretty cool stuff. I mean, there's room today. You have, a, you know, a dental, soon to be dental hygienist who's, you know, going to, I don't know, think about it. Because, you know, <laughs> I get the sweats that I don't understand. <laughs> uh, you know, but who's going to be responsible for taking care of future patients and improving quality of life? You may invent a tool and make your life easier, which as a result will make my mouth hurt less. Uh, but you know, you're, the world is yours. Uh, graphic design. I mean, who, who would have ever you know imagined that we have ways to integrate technology and art to, to really get a message through? And then we have families who have supported them to come along this way. So it's a great job. Great job, and then you have educators who are, who are forge this path. So that's the cool stuff of what we get to do. My job, as I've been sharing uh, every time, every chance I get, and every visit I make, is to advocate on behalf of uh, new resources, more resources for you. Advocate on behalf of career and technical education equipment grants and innovation opportunities and career, uh, uh, middle and high school career, college and career counselors to help kids choose their pathway moving forward, We're updating our standards so that our industry standards really align um, to the work that industry is engaged in, and more importantly, advocating to, so that the community really understands that industry certificates, two-year degrees, and four-year degrees are the way of the future, they're the way, they're the path to success. And no one more, no one of those pathways is, is more important than the other. It's a multiple pathway to success. It's a multiple pathway to improving our community. It's a multiple pathway to changing the trajectory of our economy. So for that, I'll end it how I started. I say thank you. Thank you for all you do. It's noticed, and it's greatly appreciated. Thank you very much, and enjoy the rest of your lunch. <laughs>